Hi, we're Phillips Fiber Art, and welcome to our Quilt Affair booth. This is my mom, Cheryl. Hi. This is my dad, Gary. Hi. And I'm Brooke. And Cheryl over here, she is our designer. She's our creative. It's amazing what she comes up with. This is my dad, and he is our cameraman, as well as our CEO. That's carry everything out. Ooh, and he does. He's very strong. I like it. <laughs> and I'm Brooke. I kind of get a little mix of a little bit of everything. I do shipping, calls, emails, you know, the grunt work. We better let the cameraman get to the camera. So it's a family business. It sure is. So how about we talk about some of our families? Yes, because we're a family business, and our business is families of tools. So we make innovative tools for the creative quilter. That's right, and that's you. So here's one of our family. The jewel boxes. It has to be one of my favorites. Oh, me too. They're based on fives and tens, so you can make a decagon or a pentagon, and they play together. And what other shape can we make? And we can make the star. The gem star actually makes pentagons, but it also makes these really cool stars. They can be used as appliques, ornaments. They're valuable to make. And you take the, the large tin, combine it with the gem 30, and you get the star jello. It's one I think has been around the world and back again. All right, so another family that we have is the 10 degree family. Um, we have the two-piece 10 degree, which is so cool because you ever go, man, this is a really long tool. I've got to take it to a class. This one comes in two pieces and has a bridge to... This makes how big of a circle? It makes a 50-inch circle. How much is... How big is the extension? 70 inches. Okay, and then do you remember what size? 54-inch square. A 54-inch square. That's, that's big. That's, that's big. substantial. Yeah. And when you make the square... It's sewn onto the wedges in one piece, so it's... You have a choice. You can do either or. There oh. is a little bar in the back that lets you choose to either do it with the wedge or a separate... Oh, piece. that's cool. So if I already have the circle made, I could actually add that Absolutely. back on. Absolutely. You can add that back on, and then you can make your frame. So it's very versatile. And what's this little guy over here? Smaller circles. It makes a 25-inch circle. So along with the 10 degrees, you know, sometimes families get married, you know, all those kind of things. Sometimes you get new additions. Well, we have a new addition to our 10 degree. So this is a Creative Grids 10 degree that I designed. After playing with my 10 degree for nearly 30 years, I had co collected a lot of new ideas, innovative ideas, that I think will help you, the creative quilter. Um, they are new lines. In addition to the 60 and 45 that's on the older one, this one also has a 20 and a 30 degree line. Uh, it also, you can make it come to a complete point. And with built-in right to this, into this 10 degree, it can be expanded clear up to a 65 inch circle. So it's really a neat tool that I'm so excited about. I got to write a pattern. It's called Jettison. So, it's and it pattern. uses the 20 degree line, which has been the one that we've explored the most right now. Let's. This is my favorite family, and is the family of cut arounds. You can cut the perfect circle using these tools. We have the midi, the standard, and the large. The midi cuts from four to 12. The standard cuts from 6 to 17, and the large goes from 18 to 30. We have these available in a bundle at a nice price. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's start with the family of squedges. This is a big family. We have nine tools. Tell me a little bit more about these tools. Well, the first two I want to show you um, is paired together in one package, and they make an 8-inch square. The next one is also packaged, two in a package, and it makes a 12 inch square. Inside the package on both of these is a 45 and a 22.5. Well, that's a really good value. All these other ones I have all make a 16, and I also have a 22.5 and a 45. 
So this one is made with a 22.5. This one's made with a 45, and this one is a combination between the 22.5 and the 45. Here's a sampler quilt that shows all three sizes being used. The 16 inch is shown in red, the 8 inch is shown in green, and the 12 inch is shown in black. They work so perfectly together. Let's set aside the smaller blocks and focus on the rest of these. So within the 16s, are there any of the tools that really go together well? Oh, good question, Brooke. These three here really work together well. Now you've noticed we've introduced a new character. Oh, the 11.25. That's a little guy, but he's That's really a cute. Good guy. Can you see how we're going to put these together? Well, mathematically, I think I have an idea. Okay. But go ahead and tell me. Two 22.5s make a 45 and four 11.25s make a 45. Oh, that, that's gonna look really interesting. You could play a lot with your colors. Yeah, and if you look at the block as one quarter of a 16 inch square, then each of those units could be different. So we have, we have some really basic math. What else is gonna work together? Okay, there's two others that really work together, and that is the 15 and the 30. It's pretty simple <laughs> because it's 15 plus 15 is 30. So you can take two of these and make one of this. What about that last one? Okay, that one's the squedge 18. We normally look at that block being divided this direction. Mm -hmm. We're gonna turn it and you're gonna have that triangle. And now with the triangle, you can do some really fun things. Let me show you the sample. Now this is star-crossed 18. It's so much fun. See how you get this line here? That's what makes the 18 so special. So the really cool part is it looks like it's on point, but you don't have to sew it that way. Your block ends up being right here. So here's your triangle. You sew your two triangles together and you create a block. That block can be sewn row by row. Really nice, pretty look to it. I love the colors. I do love the colors. She picked them out. She's good with color. <laughs> so that's it. Are we done with the squidges? Oh, we've just begun. Let me show you what else you can do. Each one of these squedge tools have, has lines printed on it. And the lines give you different angles, 45 and 60, going in opposite directions for each one. So give me some examples of that. Okay, well let me show you this sampler quilt. All the blocks you see in this sampler are available on our website and they're free. Oh, well that is super cool. Is I cool? gotta say, I do love free stuff. Oh yeah, we have got, oh, what, 60, 65 free patterns? Yeah, I think so. It's... If you can't the blocks, it's, it's really pretty cool. When you look at the fact that that 16 inch block a quarter of that, whether it's a square or a triangle, can be combined with any one of these tools. So, so many possibilities. We're trying to make innovative tools for the creative quilter. That's what we're all about. That's what we're trying to do. Our show special is free shipping. Use your coupon QAF2020 for 805 off your order. This will be your amount of shipping. If your shipping is a little bit more than that, go ahead and pay it and I'll refund it right away. Thank you for sharing your time with our family. This is Phillips Fiber. It's just the three of us. We strive to offer personal service because we really do care. Thank you and have a great day.